India's second Made in India nuclear submarine to be launched within a month. India's second indigenous nuclear submarine is likely to be launched in less than a month's time, towards the end of September or the beginning of October, government sources said. Launching of a boat refers to the process of transferring the vessel to the water from a dry dock. Once launched, the boat will undergo extensive sea trials before it is inducted in the Indian Navy sometime in 2019. The launch is likely to be done by Defence Minister Nirmala Sitharaman in keeping with the tradition that a boat is launched by a woman. The first indigenous nuclear submarine, INS Arihant, was launched in 2009 by former Prime Minister Manmohan Singh's wife, Gurs Harankar. INS Arihant was quietly inducted in the Indian Navy in August 2016. It was the first nuclear attack submarine built by a country other than one of the five permanent members of the United Nations Security Council. Being built under the Advanced Technology Vessel ATV, project at the Ship Building Centre in Visakhapatnam, the second boat, Arid Hayman, will have double the number of missile hatches than its predecessor. It will also be powered by a more powerful reactor than INS Arihant's 83MW Press Sunrise Light Water Reactor. Arid Hayman will have a seven-blade propeller powered by a press sunrised water reactor and can achieve speed up to 12 to 15 knots on surface and 24 knots underwater. It has eight vertical launch tubes and can carry up to 24 indigenously developed K-15, Sagarika, missiles or 8 K-4 missiles. The K-15 has a range of 750 km while the K-4 has a range of 3,500 km. INS Arihant has four vertical launch tubes and can carry 12 K-15 missiles or 4 K-4 missiles. The K-4 missile was developed as the Agni-3 missile could not be deployed on INS Arihant due to space constraints. Thank you for watching please like and subscribe.